Hi Cooking Cronies, it's Diana here. It's a nice chilly morning here in Colorado and I'm spending the day with my grandson. So we decided since it was a chilly day, we wanted to make some chili con carne and he wanted to be my sous chef. So this video shows his little hands uh, helping grandma. So we started off with uh, three pounds of um, I started off with three pounds of hamburger meat and cut that in half. So just used a pound and a half. We used uh, about three quarters of an of an onion, and I put that in the food processor and we pulsed it till it um, became fine. Uh, I added. Uh, we used about um, half of a tablespoon of minced garlic. My red chili pepper, um, chili powder. We used a quarter of a cup of that. And um, two cans of Kuhner pinot beans, because that's what I had on hand, and I did drain them. And then one can of whole tomatoes. And um, I put those, I, I drained the juice out of the tomatoes and then put the tomatoes in the food processor and uh, pureed them. So um, here shows my grandson browning the hamburger meat. I added the onions to the hamburger meat well, well, they, while it was browning and seasoned it with cumin, salt, and pepper. And then once that was browned well, the red chili was added and cooked a bit. Then the um, pinto beans were added. And again, I drained them. I didn't rinse them. I just drained them. And um, there was some juice left in the can because I didn't put them in a strainer or anything. I just I just left the lid on the can and drained them that way. And um, then once that was um, incorporated, then the tomatoes were added in and we just let it simmer. And it turned out delicious. I hope you guys give it a try. I'm on the mend. I had a total right hip replacement. I still need a total left hip, but that's um, on the waiting list. But I am cooking again, and I look forward to providing some recipes to you every week. Thank you, and God bless.